And joining us live is Tom Capone. What up, Satan? <laughs> what up, my guy? What's happening, man? What's good? Hey, Tom. What up, how Tom? You be? No doubt. Hi, Andre, how you doing, Rick? And first of all, you crushed that. And they, they cheated okay. you on the Oscar. We just mad about that. <laughs> 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 they, they, they cheated you. But you know, these these type of type of films are ones that we need, right? Because they, they bring together like they bring people into to our past and let people connect up with Billie Holiday and see what she had to go through. Now, I, I gotta ask, is it was it something when you were preparing for? Was it one thing that you you didn't know about Billie? You were like, oh, word, you found that out? Yeah, I mean, for me, it was the Jimmy Fletcher piece. You know what I mean? I knew that the government went after her. I think that was the incentive for me in saying yes to the role because I was really nervous and I didn't. I was apprehensive. I didn't want to do it at first but i think in saying yes to the book, it was um it was uh just knowing the depth that the government went after her i knew they went after her but like you know they infiltrated every aspect of her life you know she really had almost like a paranoia walking around and then to have this person infiltrate her personal life and her personal space we don't really know the extent to their relationship but we do know it it was a close relationship and could have been intimate so that was a revelatory piece for me i, I didn't know about that and you know, I just thought, man, you know, she had to fight so hard constantly, not just externally, but also internally. So it's, it's really impressive what she was able to do for for not just our people, but just people in general, you know. So that I was really moved by, by her story even more after learning about that piece. Yeah. So, I mean, you, you're a singer by trade, you're a singer, but then you like to say, telling Tig, you like, you know, an actress, you like, yo, I didn't know. Now going into Billy had some dark parts to her. Now was was that tough for you to, to find that to, to do that? Was it to get into that that mode? Yeah, I mean some of it was enjoyable, but <laughs> but no, it was it was <laughs> it was rough. I mean it was rough. You know, there's a lot of just her behavior and her mannerisms that are different. You know, so like I don't you know. Simple stuff, just choices I made in my life. I don't typically cuss, try to express myself in different ways. Well, I didn't before the movie. <laughs> but, um, you know, not smoking cigarettes, losing a bunch of weight, drinking, and all that stuff. You know, just in general, being more reckless with my body and with my behavior in my relationships with people. I I let that really permeate my life, you know. So, And it takes a toll, even on your relationships. Even my mother, it was, like, really difficult for her. <laughs> my mom, though, is thrilled as hell. My mom would always be like, you know, I'm telling my mom, you know, I'm preparing for the movie, I'm blah, blah, blah. So I would like say something wild and she would be like, what's wrong with you? And I'm like, baby, what are you yeah. talking about? What's wrong? Why, are you, why are you acting so different? I'm like, you know why I'm acting different. <laughs> so no, it wasn't easy. <laughs> it was a commitment on my hat, on my part. It was a commitment on Lee's part, on the rest of my cast part, my acting coach, and a commitment on my family's part too, you know? Yeah, for sure. You definitely got in your bag, and we're looking forward to the performance. We with the military energy. Energy. Go ahead. Hey. We're with it. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks a lot. Good talking to you. Well, My brother, Tom. Tom Capone.